in the Napa Valley. Um, the Luminous is coming from um, one of the sub-appellations called Oak Knoll, one of the newer sub-appellations right next to Carneros. And so it is um, definitely one of the coolest sites in the valley. Um, the plant material, and I don't want to get, you know, if, if, if someone's going, okay, this is too much, right? Um, just raise your hand and go, that's enough, just move on. Let's talk <laughs> about that, let's just start drinking wine. Um, <laughs> But for the Luminous, that is being sourced from a selection of Dijon clones. And why that matters is Dijon clones ripen earlier than the classic um, clone that has been grown in Napa Valley um, for Chardonnay. And so that means that we pick the, the um, grapes earlier and they make a more delicate style of wine, more elegant. So you get more minerality, um, a very polished mouthfeel. And then in terms of the winemaking approach, when we, especially if we compare it to the Reserve Chardonnay, you're, you're going to pull back. It's not going to see as much um, new oak. I'm still Lee stirring, and um, for those of you who, I think everybody here know Lee's, the dead yeast, and they're, I mean, I love Lee's. I would have a love affair with Lee's, except it would just be odd, so I won't do that. <laughs> um, but what they, what they can bring to a wine is really fantastic. Um, you get this creaminess, you get this nuttiness, you can get some toasty characters, and they just very, um, they do a wonderful job of protecting the wine.